All right, y'all, it's your boy Mark back with another video. This would be rank Wednesday number 91, I believe. And since I did a thing showing off my NXT DVDs, why not rank each NXT DVD? Um, so yeah, um, yeah, um, let's go on with it. Uh, week, uh, so fourth place, by far the weakest in my opinion, but still a dang good and worthy to own DVD. Uh, NXT Greatest Matches Volume 1. Uh, I mean, like, I get OCD from that saying Volume 1 because that implies that there's going to be more volumes of this. And I guess, technically, um, the other three would be Volume 2, 3, 4, but they're not labeled that. They're called something completely different. So that kind of gives you OCD. But, like, the reason why this is last place, it's still a good DVD, but there's a ton of uh, repeat matches on this. Um, for real, um, I don't know, maybe at the time they weren't repeat matches, but, like, there are matches on here that ended up becoming on other DVDs as well, and even one that, one of, one of the matches, I think, Charlotte versus Sasha Banks, that was also on this one, uh, but, um, you know, repeating, like, but I think it was a Blu-ray exclusive for that, and this one was on the regular edition, you know, but, um, yeah. I, I fell asleep and woke up to the menu of this, so that's a good memory of mine. That That's just, an, that's just a nice feeling, isn't it? For real. Um, but yeah, fourth place, still dang good, still worthy of owning. Uh, and I haven't actually watched all of these, by the way, like, in full. Like, I've watched, like, bits of each of them, obviously, like, but, um, I still love them, I still love having them, but next up, third place, and it's still awesome, this, a huge improvement from that, in my opinion, but, like, that's still great, NXT from Secret to Sensation, um, the big thing about this, honestly, for me, was that Sami Zayn, Shinsuke Nakamura, take over Dallas match, there's other great stuff on here, too, but, like, that especially is, like, the selling point, I reckon, for this. Still an awesome thing. There was like, it has like a top 25 NXT stars list. I think we should have just like, not do that. <laughs> Who cares about these lists, you know? And just put in more matches. Because, you know, matches in general are like hard to find on this, you know? Like, match, like matches from NXT are like barely on there. Barely on physical media, I mean. But awesome stuff. Um... Yeah, there's a couple of repeats on here too, like that Finn Balor Samoa Joe match was also on the Finn Balor for everyone DVD, which um which uh came out after this, but still ended up becoming by default a repeat match. Um you know, but yeah. And also that Charlotte Sasha match I told you about from there. But next up Best of NXT TakeOver 2018, second place. It can be hard to say which of these two would be number one or two, but uh, Best of NXT TakeOver 2018, this is um, amazing. Oh, man, NXT in 2018 was the bomb. And this has my, this is the only, like, DVD that has Velveteen Dream matches. And I still love Velveteen Dream. I want him to return at, at, at some point. Um, but, you know, the idiots of cancel culture just are idiots. <sighs> um, wow, a girl just misses me saying she had sex last night. But, yeah. Um, yeah, tons of amazing stuff. Um... There's, like, three Velveteen Dream matches on here. The only ones released on DVD, on physical media, sadly. Uh, they, sh they should have put his match with uh, Alistair Black on this one. And, yeah, that, that goes to my number one. Easily number one for me. Well, not, not easily, but, like, NXT Best of 2017. Oh, my gosh. Not a single repeat match on this. Even technically, that one has a repeat match, you know, because, cause like, they did release, like, for the UK exclusive, like, as a bonus for WrestleMania 34. Um, 
and actually take over the, uh, New Orleans. So, the, the one match, that amazing ladder match, is technically a repeat match on this. This one, none whatsoever. No repeat matches, just three discs of bang and stuff. And heck, I've only watched disc one. But, oh man, amazing stuff. And they even include the promos, like the video packages, the film packages for each match too. Well, not, maybe not. Well, each match that would have it, like the takeover matches, I guess. But amazing. And Drew McIntyre, I missed NXT Drew McIntyre, to be honest. I like early tw 2010s, like, you know, Drew McIntyre way more than Drew McIntyre now, if I'm being honest. But I liked him in NXT a lot. That, yeah. I haven't been into him as much since he came to the main roster, I will admit, deep down. Uh, but yeah, that's my ranking of each of these. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm your boy Mark. Peace out, y'all. What's the date today? April 19th. Final day of every season. Alright, peace out.